hello, just to food and yeah, this new channel I'm going to be reviewing like foods, like fast foods and stuff like that. And today I'm starting out with the Mighty Wings from McDonald's. Excuse that, that's my dog right there. Um, and so these just came out today, actually a wide release in the U.S. And I wanted to try them out and they gave me a five piece box even though there's only three pieces, so that's pretty interesting. And I got two sauces with it, which was sweet and sour and creamy ranch because I heard the creamy ranch is really good with it. And the sweet and sour is one of my personal favorite sauces from McDonald's. And I got three pieces, so I'm gonna try it. And these are my first reactions because I have not eaten these before. And you can see the nice, uh, the box is pretty nice. You got some nice detail right there. And it says Mighty Wings, it looks a little bit retro. Um, it says it's time for bone-in chicken. It's a very greasy box too. You see, share some more right there and stuff like that. And then savor the crunch, grab, or gasp, and kick. So. Yeah, pretty interesting box because it looks a little bit like a KFC box because they're usually folded like this and not like the traditional McDonald's boxes because we usually get those like containers for like the Big Mac or other burgers like that. And so I'm kind of interested how they made this. Definitely different from the McNugget boxes because those are more of like this but with no actual um, bottom part like this. So let me try my first bite. Excuse my dog right there. And yeah, let me see. Mm. Mm. It tastes a little bit like, it has that kick in it because I think it's made with cayenne pepper, I'm not sure. Like it has a spicy kick to it. And it reminds me a little bit of like back in the day at like elementary school, they had chicken just like this and it tasted a little bit like it without the kick and it smells like it. So it's pretty interesting. Not as bad as I thought it would be. It's still pretty bad when we put this right here. You can see there is the meat inside, and there is a bone, I believe, so it's not like boneless or anything like that. Mm. I don't have a really big spicy kick. Oh, yeah, it's a little bit spicy down the throat. Um, it reminds me a little bit like the Walmart wings, which I only had like once in my whole life. Cause it's a little bit hard like that. And it it has that, like the Walmart wings also have a spicy kick, but I definitely recommend these a little bit better. Cause I like the crunch to these. The other ones don't really have much of a crunch and they're really salty. So. I mean, it's okay. It's not, it's definitely not better than like the big nuggets, which are a lot cheaper. Cause this was $3 for three pieces. And make nuggets, I think it's like three dollars for ten or something like that. I'm not sure. And really it's really spicy. Well it's not it's like spicy like in the throat area and stuff like that. Like it's not really spicy in the first part. So I am going to try it with some creamy ranch because that's what I heard is good to try it with. Okay so let me see. It's definitely made for the creamy ranch because the creamy ranch kind of complements the taste. Yeah, I definitely like it with the creamy ranch. I'm curious how it would taste with the sweet and sour because it's, it the creamy ranch kind of makes it not so hot and makes it a little bit more. I'm not even sure what to describe it as, but. The sweet and sour is going to probably make it a little bit sweet. So I'm interested. I'm going to finish off this wing. I'm pretty sure by the 20th, these will be released everywhere in the States. And right now I'm in Florida.
Yeah, yeah definitely pretty spicy when they get into our area. So let me try it and I'll probably wrap up this video with the sweet and sour. Which I'm really interested because the McNuggets taste delicious with the sweet and sour. But they don't taste so good with this ranch. So this might be like the opposite. It doesn't taste so bad. Yeah, uh, I wish I would have got more sauces because I want to try it with different sauces, but with the sweet and sour, it makes it taste a little bit Chinese actually. Like, kind of a sweet orange chicken. I don't know why. So, yeah, I guess that's it. Pretty interesting product. I would definitely, I would give it maybe a C plus because um, it's definitely better than like some other fast food wings. Like what other places have wings? I think Checkers have wings. Uh, I'm not sure, but some other places have wings and it's definitely some of the best fast food wings. But I mean, there's nothing that could beat like wing stores or stuff like that, like wing shop or wing stop or stuff like places like that. So if you were probably on the go and you were really in the mood for wings, but you didn't want to wait, maybe go to McDonald's, pick up a few Mighty Wings, um, 10 piece meal or the five piece meal, I think would be way better because you could probably get tired of these very quickly. But if you really wanted some really good wings, just stop at like Wingstop or Buffalo Wild Wings or stuff like that. And I think that these are definitely better than the Walmart wings, which is really what I'm comparing it to because this is very similar to that. And Walmart food, it tastes pretty awful. So, I mean, it's not really any surprise. But if you had to go with a sauce, I would definitely say ranch if you want to kind of make it not like too hot and more creamy and more traditional. But if you're in the mood for like something sweet with a spicy kick, I would definitely go for the sweet and sour sauce. So I would rate this a C plus. I think the value, I mean, you get three wings for three bucks isn't the best, but it's still pretty good because the wings are pretty filling. So that's really it for this review, and I'll probably see you guys later with some more fast food reviews on Just Two Food. Bye.